All right, guys, so in this video, I'm going to show you a fix on an issue that people have been having with CRU, Custom Resolution Utility, and I know people are going to be having this issue. So if you haven't done anything with CRU, guys, the Custom Resolution Utility, this video isn't for you. This is people that have tried to force display scaling by using the CRU and making a stretch resolution out of it. So the way you're going to know for sure if you did do the steps right in CRU, and you've probably seen this in the videos you watched of it. So for instance, my second monitor here is display scaled, and I did do the CRU with it. You'll know it's stretched because right now it's a 1920 by 1080p monitor, and I stretched it to 1904 by 1071 to do a little less pixels for better FPS. Anyways, the desktop resolution is 1904 by 1071. You know you'll be display scaled, if the active signal resolution is also 1904 by 1071, the same as your desktop resolution. So if you were on a GPU scaled monitor, like I'm going to show you here, oh, I could just go right here. So if I were to try to do the CRU on this, the desktop resolution would change to 1904 by 1071, but the active signal resolution would stay 1920 by 1080 because it's GPU scaled and it doesn't have a display scaler. So if you're like this monitor here, and both of your stretched reses are on active and desktop, you know you're true GPU scaled. And that's good. That means you did the steps right and you are running display scaling, which will give you less input lag. But the bad news is when people are opening up Fortnite, they're getting black bars because you want to stay on full screen when you're in Fortnite. And the only way you don't get the black bars is if you do windowed full screen, which you never want to do. But when you change it to full screen, you get the black bars. And I can't show you an example of this just because I... I'm not GPU scale, but I will show you how to fix it. So let's just say you're loaded up and you have the black bars. What you're going to want to do, there's two different steps you could do. So the first thing you're going to want to do is obviously close Fortnite and then open up the game user settings. So if you type percent local app data percent, the first thing you could do is delete the Fortnite file. You can delete the Fortnite game file, and then the next time you load up Fortnite, it's going to give you fresh settings. You're going to want to press uh, decline when you first load in. And then when you switch the uh, resolution to, or not the resolution, when you switch the mode to full screen, it's still going to give you the black bars, but it's just sometimes a good thing to get a fresh game file. So it's still going to uh, switch to full screen. I mean, and give you the black bars once you load up back into Fortnite after deleting the file. It's still going to give you the black bars, but then you want to reset all your settings. The, you know, the view distance, the textures, and everything like that. So once you have everything set how you like it, even though you still have black bars, then you want to save that and exit Fortnite and then come back into the game files. If you don't feel like uninstalling the file, you can just come right into the game user settings to make the switch. So make sure Fortnite's closed and make sure you uncheck read only. If you're getting the black bars, what you're going to want to do is right at the top here, you're going to want to switch full screen mode to one from zero to one. Okay. I'm going to switch it back to zero just because I don't need this, but you want to switch full screen mode to one. And then there's one more down here. It's preferred full screen mode. I just got to find it. Right here. So it's underneath last confirmed full screen mode. So preferred full screen mode. Preferred full screen mode. Change that from 0 to 1. Once again, I'm going to change it back just because I don't need this. So once you change preferred full screen mode to 1, and then you change full screen mode on the very top here to one. Once again, I'm switching it back to zero, but you want both of those to one. I'm going to make sure I didn't leave mine on one. Preferred full screen mode zero. Okay, so once you have both those to one, the full screen mode at the top and full screen, preferred screen, full screen mode here to one, when both of those are at one, you hit file. You're going to go to file, save, exit out, and then make sure you press read only. If you don't use read only, it probably will work, but then if you accidentally change a setting in the graphic settings, it sometimes wants to force it back to the black bars. 
for some reason. So if you hit read only, it's not going to change that. So once you press read only after you change full screen mode and preferred full screen mode to one, check read only, hit apply, and OK. Oh, and one more quick thing. If you did delete the file to want to get a fresh file, just remember to switch display gamma back to 1.000000. Make sure show grass is on false and make sure B disable mouse acceleration. B disable mouse acceleration is set to true from false. And then also make sure resolution quality is on 100 and then the rest of your textures and view distance and everything is on zero. That's only for people that have remade the file because it's going to change it all back to default. But if you didn't delete the file to want to start fresh, then you'll be good. So just make sure you save that. Oh, I already saved it. And then read only and then press OK and then load into Fortnite and it will work. I hope this really helps, guys. I know people are going to be having this issue because I saw in the comments of another person's video that they were getting black bars and it was annoying. So I hope that this will help people. Let me know in the comments if it does. Please like and subscribe, guys. I've been trying really hard to put out some tips and tricks videos for you guys, and I have a lot more to come. So just let me know in the comments what you'd like to see, and we will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.